What is TACAN in aviation? If you're curious about the navigation systems used by military aircraft, you're about to learn about a crucial tool that has been in use for decades. Let's explore what TACAN is and how it works. TACAN, or Tactical Air Navigation System, is a navigation system designed primarily for military aircraft. It helps pilots determine their bearing and distance from a ground or shipborne station. This system is essentially the military version of the VOR DME system used in civil aviation, but it's more accurate and operates on different principles. Taken works in the UHF frequency band between 962 and 1213 MHz. When an aircraft equipped with Taken avionics sends out interrogation pulses, the Taken station responds with pulse pairs that help the aircraft calculate its slant range distance. This distance measurement is similar to how civilian DMEs work, using the round trip time of the pulses to determine the distance. For bearing information, uses amplitude modulation of the pulse pair signals. The station's directional antenna, or an electronic antenna array, generates these signals, which include a fundamental 15 Hz signal and an auxiliary 135 Hz signal. These signals help improve the accuracy of the bearing information, making TACAN more precise than the standard VOR system. TACAN stations can be identified by Morse code, which periodically replaces the ranging pulses with a three-letter identification code. This ensures that pilots can confirm they are receiving signals from the correct station. One of the key benefits of TACAN is its versatility. It can be used for en route navigation and non-precision approaches to landing fields. The system is also compact and can be installed on various platforms, including buildings, trucks, airplanes, and ships. In air-to-air -air mode, TACAN allows two aircraft to determine their relative distance and, in some cases, their closure rate and bearing. Historically, TACAN evolved from radio transponder navigation systems like the British Oboe system during World War II. In the United States, companies like Hoffman Electronics Corp. played a significant role in developing TACAN in the late 1950s. TACAN stations often co-locate with VOR facilities forming what is known as Vortac stations. These stations provide both civil and military navigation information, making them highly efficient. However, TACAN has some drawbacks. One major issue is the lack of stealth capabilities, as the system's emissions can be detected by enemy forces. To mitigate this, some TACANs operate in a demand-only mode, transmitting only when interrogated by an aircraft. With advancements in technology, TACAN systems have become more reliable and efficient. Modern antennas use electronic rotation instead of mechanical, reducing the need for high output power and making the system more portable and reliable. In recent years, TACAN has been largely replaced by GPS systems, such as the Joint Precision Approach and Landing System, JPALS, which offer better stealth capabilities and precision. However, TACAN remains an important part of aviation history and continues to be used in certain military contexts. So there you have it. TACAN is a sophisticated navigation system that has played a vital role in military aviation for many years. Its accuracy, versatility, and compact design make it a remarkable piece of technology.